okay. We created an inventory program for Jester B using Memento database. Here is how it works. So first, open the Memento database, this one. Upon opening, this is what you will see on your screen. Feeding, split and drop, pick and transfer, grading, grade and pick up, timesheet, task list. These are what we call libraries. So let's go to timesheet first. This is what you see when you open it. It has no entries yet, meaning no data is on the library. To put data on the library, click the lowest right blue button with plus sign, this one. Upon creating an entry, meaning putting a data, this is what you will see. Okay. You may put data on the fields there. It will automatically compute your total time. Okay. Let's put user kit cut date to date time start time 5.38 break time no. For this one, I will not fill it all yet. I will go back to this library later after I finish doing all my tasks and create entry. Then, tada! I have one entry in timesheet. If you press this, you will see the summary. Okay. Then, let's go to task list. This one. If you are an admin, you will assign tasks to your workers. This is how you assign tasks to them. Create entry. Then put the yard. Um, select the yard they will work on. For example, Doan. What tasks they're going to do in Doan? Feed, split, grade. Um, that's all. Assign to whom? So let's see. Let's say Kate. Date uh, tomorrow. Okay, and create entry. So here, summary Doan, yard Doan, what task to be done. Feed, split, and grade to whom? Keith, and deadline is 7 25 2020. Okay. Create entry as many as you want. Your worker should check this every day before doing task. Then let's go on feeding. For example, I perform inventory in yard doan. So let's create entry. Yard doan. Then I will enter the data I gathered. As you can see, hive spot and nook spot will automatically show. For your doan, for your sugar meal, it also show. Uh, shocks. Okay, let's go back to doan. Mm -hmm. Available high spot, 2017, available nook spot, 2017, because I haven't put the data I gathered. So, hives count may be, let's say, 100. Suppers, second suppers count, let's say, 10. Third is 2. Nooks count, let's say 102. Strong nooks, 50. Dead hives count, 5, 5, 5. Just for example, date, day to day. Worker, of course, me. So available hives, 176 and 170. For 276 minus uh, hive count, 100. So it should be 176. Nooks count, 270 minus nooks count, 100. 170 then create entry okay here you can see the highlights yard doan 176 is the available hive spot 170 is the available nook spot the date they visited doan and who whose worker okay if you press this you will see the summary okay if you want to sync this on this data on Google Sheet, just enter this. Okay. Okay. 
okay but if you have no internet connection it's okay it will automatically sync if you have if you're an uh, if you have connection so split and drop okay mm -hmm. so just wait let's see this entries no we don't have data yet nox made nox load to track nox drop oh, let's see split and do split i'll do splitting date is today oh i'll do splitting on let's say doan nox made i made 100 for example high split 50 color oh uh, yellow worker of course me Num number of looks load to track i just look load 50 then create entry so it will highlight what i entered doan yard doan what did i do split worker kit and date is 724 and then i will also do dropping date 24 yard uh, maybe i'll drop to sugar mill number of nooks drop i'll drop Mm, I'll drop 40. And then worker is mm, then create entry. So this is the highlights. Sugar meal, what did I do? What did I do? Drop. Okay. So here nox made 100. Nox load to track. 50 nox drop 40. So we have 10 nox still on the track. So pick and transfer. I have no data yet. So I'll create entry. I'll do pick up date then day yard pick up for example do a nox pick up fifty for example and note testing and worker is just me. Okay, then I'll create entry. I also do let's see transfer nooks date today yard uh, yard I'll transfer to sugar mill for example number of nooks transferred for example 30 number of hives created maybe 5 then kit and then create entry ok I have two entries now if I press this one it will show the summary and also this one and show you i can edit this okay i can edit this okay okay then grading let's go to grading oh let's create entry doan okay worker hives i grade for example this is 50 30 20 10 total hives Okay, 50 plus 30 plus 20 plus 10. And looks, and looks, grade is 50, B is 30, and grade C is 20. So 80. Then I'll create entry. Okay, grade. Grade and pick up. Uh, let's create entry. Grade for cell. Okay, to yard. Um, so on. Hives ready to sell. Let's say 30. And looks ready to sell. Let's say 40. Then create entry. Also, let's see pick up. Go on. Pick up hives 60. Pick nooks 70. Create entry. Okay. Okay. Then let's go back to timesheet. Let's press this and edit. I have my break. Okay. I do PD splitting, pick and transfer. Okay. And edit entry. Total time zero. <laughs> <laughs> let's edit again <laughs> for example a resume on 6 p.m and end my time on 10 p.m okay so my total uh, time is four okay done okay done bye bye thank you